guys. And with me here, what we have is a puzzle box. It's not the same as the other one. Same idea from brick by brick. I'm not, I don't know how to put links, but just, it's there. Yeah, he's made two puzzle blocks so far that I've seen. Point, or puzzle box one and puzzle box two and that sort of thing. And this is the same idea, just a little bit smaller. I have various sizes. And so let's complete it. So you take the key out of here. You can either place it in like that and push it out. And this key is sized a little bit differently. It's kind of an odd one, but push that out to get it. But I personally like this. You push that out. And then that, there you go. And what you have is a little prize. And right now I have a creeper in here. Er, creeper. Zombie. And so, let's begin. What we are going to be starting with, with this puzzle box, is the base. What you are going to need for the base is this. It's, go it's actually, and if you haven't checked out my other two videos, we, uh, we made this chair and this prison cell. It's going to be the same as this roof on the prison cell. And it, it is going to be a 6 by 12. I guess 6 by 12. Leave these bricks here. Then these bricks here. And then this one. And fill in the rest. Doesn't matter what you do. And not, not this build as well is not going to be color coded like the same colors. So next, what we are going to be doing, grab a 2x2 two two and place it right here. This is going to be like our little stopper for this when it pushes it out. And then there. And then we are going to fill in the rest like this. And just make a layer like that. There you go, but this next layer is going to be a little bit different. It's going to be with plates. But, and it, with this as well, this part's going to be different as well. We are going to be doing, we are going to be completely surrounding it with bricks. So from here. And then we are going to be going all the way down with this. And that, so this is the pieces. Two by two, two by four, and two by eight. And they are all plates. And then for the next one, it's going to be an overhang two by two. But it's going to be an overhang two. It's going to be two. Two by four there. So then what we are going to be placing first out of this is going to be this is going to be a key part from your little like holder thingy to not falling out technic axle this one is actually permanent in but you could get a two by two with a hole in it and then do that and then get another one with a hole in it and then there so but i happen to have that other piece so what we are going to be doing Putting a uh, two by two there, and a uh, two by two there. It's gonna be like a little big block there, and then for the back, we are actually going to be doing this right here, and this right here. Once you build the whole thing, the top's gonna kind of hold it in place, and then the key's gonna kind of wear it in a bit to staying like that, if you know what I mean. And then what next, so I'm actually going to get a 2x2, two two, or 2x1. Two and then uh, next I'm going to be getting two or 1x8. And then, so we have that there. And then I'm going to grab a 1x3 and a 1x1. One one. 
and then next a two by four here so then it, you got these layers done so next what we are going to be doing is the next layer this is the last or yeah last complete um you know brick layer so we got a one by two two by four and this piece is going to be going back here Oops. that piece came out I actually recommend right now to stop building that and what and then the key so we are going to start with a uh, one by eight and then this is gonna be like the uh, we are going to put there a two by two tile and then right here is going to be a two by three and then we are going to put a tile. Right now I have a grill, but it doesn't matter. It's just as long as it doesn't have studs on the top. And then uh, next we are going to be placing another 2x2 two two tile. And put that there. And then to finish us off with a 1x6. And then right now we are going to be placing that into here. Doesn't matter right now. And then we're, we're going to build these up first, but now we have the support for that. So then you are going to be getting a 1x6, placing that there. And then we are going to be getting a 2x6, placing that there. And so that's your last like brick layer. We, next, we are going to be doing the plate layer, last plate layer, and then, so that's actually going to be a 2x6 there, or 2x4, sorry, 2x4 there, I'm not good with pronouncing my Lego name pe names for pieces, and then 2x4, um, Ten. So then now you're done those layers. So next we are going to be building the top here. Sorry, the thing came man. And I'm gonna be speaking a little louder. We are going to start with to fit in there this. Scooch it to the side. Or this doesn't matter how you do it as long as it's that with studs on the top. One by six, but it's two layers high. And then uh, going to be doing, kind of doubling that. Another one, just two by six, two layers high. Have those two. And next, you're going to be grabbing. You might find it obvious to fit that, but it's going to be a little uneven right here. So then, then what you're going to be grabbing is this four by six with a tile in the middle then you're going to be connecting this to the bottom of it and then this to the other bottom sorry this video is taking a little longer than i hoped and then on the sides do this on the same sides right there one by four and a one by two. Same with the other side. One by four, one by two. And there you go. So now, next we are going to be grabbing a one by four, and then placing a one by six on top of that. And then putting that back for a wall. But here's where there's an important you're going to be getting your 1 by 2 with a hole in the middle. 
that's going to be going right here so it lines up with this part. So then you're going to be putting two one by ones on the side of that. And then one by six right there. And then next we are going to load the top with tiles. So one by six there. Adding a one by six over here. And putting a one by four. Or one by three here, sorry. One by three. One by four. So I'm doing a lot of videos tonight. And um just so I pronounce. Then I'm doing gonna do the same with this over here. I just don't have those pieces. It's a little plate thing. But congratulations. So there you go there. So there just needs to be tiles on the top, something smooth. So you're gonna take your key out, place that in there. So you'll hear a clicking sound. You should. And then putting your key in there. Oh, I I'm sorry, I made a mistake. See these two pieces? I made it so this is here. The one by six, whoops. The one by six has to be on the edge. With the it has to be on the same one as this hole. Right there. Let's go like that. And then putting this over here. That was my mistake. So then just clicking it all together. And then we go there. And then so now it's just a matter of fact of filling up the roof. You don't have to add tiles if you don't have like an you're like a little lack of supply on tiles. Just place that there. Two by six. And then on the other side we're just gonna fill that up. If you have another uh, if you have another six by twelve then that would be great and you could use that. But instead right here I have a six by eight. Or those are Oh my god, I'm sorry, I made a mistake. You probably noticed that in our last video. But this. These. Or, or, no, it's just me. And so, not there. I happen to have a big tile. I'm going to put in the middle. And then, don't have to put tiles on the top again. And then I'm going to put tiles in the top corner, it's just standing like this, top corner, bottom, or top corners and bottom corners, and then for the side, red one and the gray one. So then what we're going to do, complete it, open it up. Put a little prize inside, so I'm on the zombie. And then, so yeah. And there you go. Three things right here. Thanks for watching. If you stayed this long, I'm sorry that took a little bit longer than I thought. So, signing off for now. Bye.